trip to the Dominican Republic and I'm going to take you guys on the journey. Well, a culinary journey because the food was the most important part. The Straight out the airport, we went to KFC and to our surprise, KFC is just like KFC in Jamaica. Them do have no customer service and everything we wanted. The woman told us we not have that. But in the end, she felt a little bad and she gave us free churros. So at least you have a heart. We can definitely say Jamaica KFC stays on top because this was trash. They only had one flavor chicken. It was oily, greasy, gross. So the next morning we went for brunch at Vera Leite and Vera Leite is the name for street dogs. So you know like oh we have mongrel. Yeah, they call it Vera Leite. And it was so nice here. The aesthetics, everything was dog themed. So it was pretty cool. Um you could actually take a dog there if you wanted to. Loved the vibes, the decor, everything. The food was pretty good too. I'll show you what I have soon as soon as my done showing the inside of the place. had an orange juice with milk that was pretty good I had mango which is mashed plantains with some sort of bread and an omelette Dre had french toast, sausage, eggs, bananas in a syrup later in the day we had Valentino oh my god such good ice cream I love this. I was so sad that we couldn't get to go back. It was so good. Then I had some El Presidente beer. I didn't like it. It tastes like Heineken. <laughs> but the place was busting with vibes. Um, we had egg rolls and then I had some salmon trash garbage throw the whole thing away throw it away this is what how much food i left and wasted i don't know what kind of vegetable that but throw it away then because we were still hungry we went back to reality at night and we went upstairs and as in the morning it was really really good loved the aesthetics again so cute especially at night Always gotta start our mornings right with some tea. Does tea from Jamaica count as something I ate in Dominican Republic? Let me know. We went out for breakfast again and I forgot the name of this place but my friend liked it because all of the waiters were old men and I thought that was just so cute. We kept it simple. We had an omelette, French toast, there was pancakes, more mango, orange juice, cherry juice. It was pretty yummy. This is a sign of wonders. Come here, I'm going to want a little coffee. I'm going to sit in this cafe machine and the lady asked me if 
Singapore and Dominican can't be a potential no commerce yes. Come on, give me the hot pipe in a hot cut pay in a plastic cup. And this is a size comparison. How much money? 20 pesos. 20 pesos. So how much money do you use? I'm not sure how much money, but still, we need justice. Somebody call the police. Sir. So, some sort of sandwich with the popular bread. Really flat. So, down in Puerto Plata, we had a lot of home cooked meals. This one reminded me of baked chicken with stew peas without coconut milk on the side and rice that's what it tasted like to me we're supposed to eat this and leave in probably like 20 minutes pray for us Unidentified meat, unidentified meat, chicken, rice, more rice, unidentified meat, chicken foot, pepperoni, bottle fries. hungry one late night so we, I got a burrito and some fries from that food truck place you just saw I walked to that Magnum yes the beer my favorite drink a Maggie Bull Magnum sponsored me Red Bull you know the vibes we had some local pizza and corn is a famous topping would you try corn and pizza this was some sort of seasoned rice. It was seasoned with sazon, which them seem obsessed with sazon. Pretty good, kind of tangy. Um, we always had fried plantains with every meal. So this is flan. It's made of what? Sugar, egg, and milk. It has that like wetty wetty consistency because it's like cake without flour. They brown the sugar on the top. It's good. Um, but if you like things are moist, you wouldn't like it. But it's very moist. It's like again, like cake without sugar, flour. I haven't had McDonald's in years. It's a Big Mac, not no big body Mac here. We need justice. Fries. If you follow me on Instagram, then you know what's happening here. If not, follow me on Instagram. The link is in the description box. past 40 first time trying empanadas is it yeah you never had that chilitos no no we stick the food over no but it's like a little mini patty let's see Ooh. chubby you could gravy almost dash upon the man clocks what kind of clock is bank robber desert food. desert juice sweet three now nice when i done mm -hmm. This is a content creator's dream. It's pretty dead. As in like there are only other two other guests here. 
um I'm kind of, kind of have a but you kind of do, obviously. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like when you first taste, you do nothing. Line, you know, and then the meat, the meat kind of, yeah. When you start chewing, season, mm -hmm. enough for like you know, mm -hmm. us Jamaican people like our seasoning. The gravy or the sauce. Let me not talk with food in my mouth. The sauce tastes like Maggi seasoning and then just put that Maggi seasoning in our blender maybe with water like a lot of Maggi seasoning and less water and make it kind of pulpy you know it have a, that's how it tastes to me the way all nobody there the appetizer come out fast it come out fast you know, normally when you go to a restaurant, you get your appetizer and 50 oh, years right. later, mm -hmm. you just get the main course. What's steam? And literally, people just come up at the kitchen. Maybe the hottest food you'll ever eat. Right. <laughs> All of these are things you can take home. Hmm? Just stirring it. <laughs> Okay, bye. Shalom. How many do you have in one or four? I want to. I think I have like four. Mm. I think it's three. So. Wow. Every time I meet you, you try to feed me. Is this payback? I'm just not used to feeding each other. Right. Basically. I'm not used to feeding each other. Right. Right. I'm good. I got my favorite drink. Oh, one of my favorite drinks. A Priol Spritz. Love. Well, one. It tastes good. It doesn't taste good. I feel like I'm gonna taste some liquor. And normally, how people don't have never tried April, like it. <coughs> Excuse me. You get that manners. <laughs> Um, Aperol, it tastes like Campari, but like a weaker version of Campari, but it also tastes like, like a little cough medicine. And usually too, the Aperol spritz will have like, Lean, it's yeah, Aperol with champagne, so it's a champagne. Nothing but it's not bubbly. I'm going to take a little, a little carbonation in this. You want to go and eat this? When you get the thing, I read that as well. Mm. <coughs> I don't know if, if Dominicans are prunes. Is that word prune or prune? No, not prune. Not prune like a raisin. <laughs> prudes. When you're a prude like you, you're afraid to like the top of sex kind of. I don't know what to say. Like uptight. Because. Nothing about this snag in me. Like, but when I was in a video and a picture, I'll come at me. Well, it's not too late. I said, I'm not going to get no more cigarette. How rude of me. I almost didn't show you guys the pasta. The pasta was so good, so creamy, so yummy. And best of all, it came out nice and warm. You know, I'm going to get hot food from our restaurant. Crazy.
the wings honestly could have stayed because all them do was just fry the chicken wings with nothing else and come back with the maggi sauce again no these mojitos weren't bad but again nothing in comparison to what we're used to as jamaicans with the amount of alcohol in a drink yeah Then when we were leaving, I had the best pot bowl ever at the airport. I miss this pot bowl. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.